mentioned yesterday the Bosha Nikolaivit, the Bosha Grossman, Hosset of the Barash in the Tzemach, in the Rebrasha, in the Fidike Rebbe. It was a Shoichet Nikolaiv, and he was a big Balmanagin and a big Ovid. I told it stories of interesting stories to the story. They just all had one more detail how the man, I just want to talk this part of it, undertook to fast a full week. We're talking not eating night and day, six full days. Impossible? Yeah, seven days, just not now at Ambam. So it takes a vow. He won't Water. eat drink for seven days. He had wow. nothing. No food and drink for six days. Halfway through it, he had tzach. It was in day four. He didn't ask. So this story is already made. It. He didn't ask the Rebbe, the Rebbe Rashad, if he should or not. And if not getting this guidance in his words, all he's doing is starving himself. It's not a tiniest. He's not right there. Not made it. So it's already day four. He makes his way from the Kalayf to the Babich and tells the Rebbe Rashab. Apparently, the Rashab was not happy. In other words, would not have given such a derech and avayda. He said, But since you started, you should complete it. He completed it Friday night. I'm not mistaking. Kiddush Hashem. A lot of hot water. <coughs> different gear so The Rebbe Rashab made him eat. Because he gave him. Well, Friday, Rabbi Rashab prepared a whole big pot of it's hot water or hot soup, something. Didn't know why. It was for him to, to eat and also make the next day kiddush, a gun smice. It gives you an inkling on uh, who this person was. He was also tremendous bound in So, and as I told you, he was entrusted with the printing of the Tanya, which we have. And look at the third, huh? We have to the Grossman. The Bosh of Nikolai. He wanted, he wanted in the Tanya. He re, the Tanya we have the format was printed in Vilna under his auspices. It was completely checked and it's it, uh, of uh, of uh, the, the words in the language, just by the way, you noticed yesterday that Skil Chabina, which told the story, there's a brackets there. Yesterday's time. Yeah, what's the bracket? Huh? What, what's the bracket? Afshe in the Yochel. If I remember, you remember. It doesn't, doesn't make sense in this two, two gear soys. You know, it's in the brackets right. in Tanya. Okay, we'll leave that for another time. It just occurred to me yesterday. All places in Tanya here, these words, it's like it's not clear what, what the Alt ever wrote and why. But that's not for now. Let me get to the story. Look, look, this is the homework. Look at yesterday's Chitas, Tanya, and see there where the, which words, even though he's unable, why that's in brackets and what the possible, uh, another girsa of what that could mean. Yesterday's Tanya is a very heavy chapter, but whatever happens is for the good. Very strong words, and we told you the story yesterday. Upon him, so back to the Bosh Nikolai, as I told you, yesterday, Nikolai was a city famous for its Bali, Bali Menachem, authors of Nigunim, including the Rebbe Zayda Rebbe Shleim, who wrote famous Nigunim, famous Bolach, which the Rebbe used to daven to in his room, Shabbos. I don't know which use it was, but he didn't daven the minion. He daven later in his room, and outside they could hear Zalman's uncle, Maybe even his father's kids used to play upstairs there, and they could hear the Rebbe singing the Volach, famous Volach of Rebbe Shleim. There were many famous composers, and amongst them were the two brothers of Sholem and Aaron Charitonov. The name of the Babich Charitonov, so much be in 770, Sholem Charitonov, that's a grandson, he's named after his grandfather, Rebbe Sholem. And they composed many in In fact, there's a record. That the son of Absalom made, Shamshin Charitan was his name, very cute fella. <coughs> and he made a record called Nigunne Sholem, probably get it online, which he himself sings. And it's very cute and beautiful. Songs that his father composed. But Aaron Charitan was the one that composed, amongst many other Nigunne in the Benin. So tomorrow I'm going to tell you the story of the Benin, how it became the Vidic Rebbe's Nigun one associated with him. 
and a, a related song, Nigna composed. We'll leave that for tomorrow, Bezer Hashem.